Hi there, Chris here. I am going to try and pick this Ruko that uh, Brummy sent me. And this thing, <laughs> this is great. A great, beautiful, beautiful old Ruko. I think it probably has gin bottles in it, but if I can pick it, we'll see. Um, also, I asked at my hardware store if they had any of these, um, you know, this type of key, and the guy, the luck guy said no, and then the other day I was waiting for them to find some blanks, and I looked up on the little card holder, and they had these. So, I um, cut this one down so that it can fit in here, and it fits nicely, and will tension the lock. I just need to make up, because this, these levers are real close here, I need to make up the right um, pick, pick wire to be able to lift those. So stay tuned for that. Also, <laughs> on the uh, two-in-one pick that I'm dying to give a review on, um, the latest is I've sent seven emails over a week's period, the last one asking for my money back. And I've had two responses. Uh, both of them essentially say, well, we're, we're looking into it. Um, as far as giving me my money back, they said, oh, we, we would, you know, we can send you a replacement, but we have no idea if it'll work or not. And I sent back, well, why don't you call the company? Now, I want to make it perfectly clear that the company that sold these is not Andy Mack, and it's not UKLP. Um, it's not the, the lock tool, Those either of those. Both of those have excellent customer service. So anyway, this other company is uh, really on their way to getting a scorched earth review. On, they don't know what the hell they're doing or what they have, and they can't. It, in a week's time, they can't figure it out or make the phone calls or get responses to find out from the company who made the tool. Now, the company who made the tool, they're great tools, but if it's a tool specific to a specific padlock, um, lever lock, it ought to fit the, that, that specific lock, but it doesn't. So there you go. Anyway, I probably won't be able to pick this because I'm upset, but we'll see. I just see if I can get this. I'm kind of hit and miss on this thing. Yeah, I'm pissed. <laughs> Talk about totally idiot customer service. They don't even. <laughs> they, can't, they can't even get it figured out in a week. Nor do they respond. They have two two responses to my seven emails. So anyway. And it was an expensive tool, so. All right, shut up. Pick the lock. Pick this beautiful Ruko. I don't know what they can do to save this. Other than say, yeah, we figured it out. Here's the one you need. We're sending it to you. Then they will get a, a, a better review, but still, that's ridiculous. All right, come on, you can do this. You can do it. Well, that felt good. Is that one? Two? I think the tension on this is very critical little too little and you drop and a little too much and you're not getting whatever security pins past the the obstruction all right I felt something give we may be getting close Come on. Or we maybe one or 
two away instead of one away. Come on. I don't think it's that one. I don't think it's one. I don't think it's two. I'm using a different pick. I'm using a, a Sparrow's Lunatic to kind of get up in there. Four. I don't think I've set five. Might be set though, I can't tell. Well, I'm gonna keep knocking on the door here. So has anybody figured it out yet? <laughs> what, <laughs> what company? I told you who it wasn't. And also, when I run into an issue like this, I also discuss it with other people. There we go. In the Locksport community. So, because I tend to just like want to say, you know what, these guys are total idiots and blah, blah, blah. But I want to have a little restraint. I mean, things happen, but we're talking a week, so come on. All right, so we did get it open. Let's see what's inside it. I'm surprised I was able to pick that. Whoa, because my mojo goes out the window when I'm uh, irritated, annoyed, ticked off, <laughs> whatever. And I feel sorry for the company that manufactures this, this because it's a, they, they do have wonderful tools. And I'm close to trying to just trying to contact that the manufacturer directly and say, okay, this is how when people are selling your product, <laughs> pissing people off. All right, so, oh, I didn't show the bidding on the key or anything. It's got great bidding. I love this lock. I love Ruko's. This one is absolutely fantastic. So let's get this in here. And I think maybe my package to Mr. Mr. Peter Lewis has landed, and he might be going to open up a, or, yeah, do a package opening video. So there's everybody, five. Everybody needed pick to be picked. So let's get these out, he said. I guess I have to pick them out. So that's one. It's a little guy. I'll get it over there. One. That's two. That's three. No, oh, that's three. What? That's all right. Just get them out. Get them out. So it's amazing to me how so many problems our community solves with comments or emails quite rapidly. You know, if somebody knows, they tell you. All right, that's four and that's five. So that's that. And they solve your problem and you're, you know, you're going on to the next thing, whatever, whatever needs to be happening. And like I say, love Andy Mac, love UK lockpicky tools. And there's other ones, uh, Law Lock Tools. Actually, I've not bought from Law Lock Tools, um, but I did win their Valerian set, which is an awesome, awesome set. Uh oh, that was three, sorry. Oh, no, there's a wafer in there. Okay. That went there. All right, four. And we'll get five. There we go.
So little tiny gin bottles. Whoa, come here. Little tiny gin bottles and here we'll pluck a spring. So I think all the springs are the same. There it is, albeit jumping around. All right, so this is what we have in here. I love this lock. Love me, Rucos. There you go. Picked under duress. <laughs> and like I say, there's the key. Beautiful, beautiful. Don't lose your springs, Ruko. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hit the like, subscribe, leave a comment. Thank you to all my new subscribers. We're getting awful close to maybe another giveaway. All right, we will see you next time.